Hello there and welcome back to our channel. In this video, we will demonstrate how to send money from WISE to Gcash. The first thing you should do is visit the WISE website. Alternatively, you can use the WISE application if you prefer. Once on the WISE website, make sure to log into your account. For logging in, the next step is to start your transaction. At the top left of your screen, you will see the Send Money button. Click on it to load a new interface. In this new interface, you have the option to choose whether you want to send money internationally or in local currency. If you are currently in the Philippines, you can conveniently use the local currency for your transaction, which simplifies the process and eliminates the need for currency conversion. On the other hand, if you are initiating a transfer from another country, you will need to select the international option to facilitate the exchange and transfer of funds across borders. This choice ensures that your transaction is processed correctly according to the location and currency involved, allowing for a smoother and more efficient transfer process. For instance, if you wish to send $100, begin by entering the amount as $100 in the specified field. After inputting the amount, scroll down the page to review additional details and options. It is crucial to check for any plan, maintenance, or system updates on WISE, as this can impact the processing time of your transaction. Maintenance activities might lead to delays, so being aware of any scheduled downtime can help you better anticipate when your funds will arrive. Keep in mind that transaction times can vary significantly based on factors such as current traffic on the platform and prevailing exchange rates. Depending on these variables, the transfer could take anywhere from a few minutes to several hours to reach your Gcash account. After entering the exact amount you wish to send, click on Continue. You will then be prompted to choose whether you are sending the money to yourself or someone else. If you are sending it to yourself, select Myself. Instead of choosing a local bank account, select eWallet. You will then need to enter your full name and the wallet provider. Since Gcash is an eWallet, choose it from the list. Next, enter your eWallet number, which is typically your phone number if you are using Gcash. After entering your phone number, click Confirm. Finally, review your transaction details and proceed to make the payment. And that's it. Thanks for watching. Don't forget to like, subscribe, and comment below for more tutorials on your favorite apps. Happy exploring!